It's very rare that I see a home that takes my breath away because I see so many, except for today. We are in one of the most amazing penthouses in New York City. This is 52 Worcester Street, the top three floors, incredible interior space, and even better roof deck space, all of the amenities you could possibly ask for. And I know it's gonna take your breath away too. And I'm so excited to show you this incredible Soho penthouse. This is one of our newest Sir Hans signature listings. Let's go. Fifty Two Worcester is a boutique condominium building in Soho, and it's pretty new. It only finished a couple of years ago, and this apartment has barely ever been lived in. So it's new construction for all intents and purposes. It's nearly 4,300 square feet of interior space over two floors, three bedrooms plus a personal gym or home office or den or baby's room, three and a half bathrooms, and then an additional 1,163 square feet on the roof. Finding a condo in Soho is rare enough, but finding a new construction condo, let alone a penthouse, is like finding a needle in a haystack. You're finding a diamond. They're so rare because they're so hard to build. Soho is landmark, it's historical. It's very, very tough to build new here, except for this building. Years and years and years went into the planning to get this building here to allow this penthouse to even exist. So the opportunity, in my mind, is really once in a lifetime. But I wanna start here. And this is what loft living is all about. You've got 32 huge windows that let in so much natural light, which is hard to find in Soho or in Lower Manhattan. Typically, you have windows up at the front and you don't really have a view, and then your windows in the back are really, really dark. Every single room in this penthouse is bright. It's a light, it breathes. And you don't just have one outdoor space, you have three, which I'm gonna show you. Big open living space, gorgeous stone clad marble fireplace, huge space for TV. You've got extra high ceilings. These are 11 feet, a little bit higher, and everything's fully built in. Everything's wired, all the speakers, all the electronics, everything is so new, it's crazy. And this first floor, when you hit penthouse in the elevator, is all about entertaining. Now there's a bedroom on this floor too, one of the three, and right now it's being used as a den. I think it works really well that way. But if you're having a party, you're having a cocktail party, you're having people over, they can just come right to this floor. So living space, entryway, foyer space, everything's lofty but it's new at the same time, which is amazing. This incredible dining room, hung overhead chandelier, Really, really cool. It draws all of your attention to the ceiling. And I love these big pocket doors because you can totally shut off what's right behind you. But I prefer when these doors are open because I am obsessed with this kitchen. Now, when our owner bought this apartment, it was brand new. Everything was perfect. And he totally ripped up the kitchen and built something incredible. Now, this is a chef's kitchen, if you ask me. Gorgeous Carrera stone, countertops extra thick, and on the backsplash, massive eight burner blue star. Like you're cooking dinners or meals for all of Soho here. Like this is the real deal. Pot filler, everything completely vented out. They had a custom mill worker do some of the most fantastic custom cabinetry I've seen in a kitchen, wrapping all the way throughout. You also have a full open wet bar and pantry. Three, not just one, three separate wine refrigerators two of the extra large ones, and then one of the mini refrigerators. And then, you know what I love actually most about this apartment? There's a lot, but all of the windows. You have a windowed kitchen in Soho. You've got this one, we've got that one, and then you've got all these details. Look at this, you've got a spice cubby. Instead of having these things sit out on the countertops or away, they go into this little cubby that's made out of stainless steel and you can put your spices and your salt and your pepper in there. That is an attention to detail, as is the under lighting underneath all the cabinets. This is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful kitchen. I love it. And then behind me is our first bedroom. Like I said, set up like a den. It's got this amazing space for a TV. There's a gorgeous full bathroom right here. So this totally closes off if you need it as a third bedroom. Windows on both sides. And then let me show you our first outdoor space. 
This is right off the kitchen and this first bedroom. I mean, this is an outdoor terrace and a patio. You could put chairs out here. You've got a high glass railing, you keep the door open, your dog can just come out here and do their business. Which in New York City, especially Soho, like, this is so hard to find. Like, this is amazing. Now let's go downstairs to the bedroom suites. And there's a lot more than just bedrooms. Now, what I love about this floor, again, is because the building is a corner, right? You have windows on all sides. So even in a typically kind of darker area in between rooms, in this building, in this penthouse, you have a windowed room. I could put up a wall here. This is a fourth bedroom. It's huge, but it's open. The millwork is gorgeous, and it works as a really, really great library. Seating room. You could put a huge desk here. This could also be a home office if you want it to be. And then you've got our second bedroom. And I'm, like, I'm obsessed with this room because my views aren't just into Soho. My views are all encompassing. I've got the water towers that are so classic. I've got the architecture of these older cast iron buildings. And I'm looking at all of them through these floor to ceiling corner glass windows that open, by the way. So you can get natural air, which is another huge plus here. And my views are also out onto the Worcester Street cobblestones. Just beautiful, amazing. I'm looking down at Gucci right now. I'm looking down at my headquarters right now. Gucci, my headquarters. And then you've got lots of closet space and a full ensuite bathroom, floor to ceiling marble, radiant heat, and it's barely ever been used, if ever. Down the hall at the other end of the apartment, past your private gym and your laundry room that has two washers and two dryers, we have our primary suite with two incredible walk-in closets. Huge windows, massive ceilings, gorgeous lighting. I love the decor in here. And then we've got another outdoor space. But then the piece de resistance of the interiors here, look at the stone, look at this bathroom. It is unreal. Look how gorgeous this is. We are clad all the way through. We got a huge window that's frosted for privacy over the floating bathtub out into the outdoor space. We've got windows here in the vanity, floating mirrors, tons of counter space, and a bidet. This is like a six fixture bathroom. It's the definition of luxury. I love this. Last but not least, let's go see the roof. The roof deck. Nearly 1,200 square feet of private roof space. The definition of a penthouse. And it's huge and it keeps going. So let's start here. You've got an outdoor hot tub just for you. We have it covered right now because it's December. An outdoor shower, powder room, one grill here, and then we have a whole separate outdoor kitchen at the other end. The outdoor kitchen, gorgeously clad in stone with a waterfall, has an ice maker, storage space, a mini refrigerator and a sink. So it's a full, full kitchen. You've got access to gas out here, water, electric. You've got an outdoor movie theater, fireplace, and your lounge. And that is the penthouse at 52 Worcester. One of my favorite, favorite apartments in all of New York City. And one of the prime penthouse offerings to ever hit the market in Soho. This is one of our newest Sirhan signature listings. Thank you so much for watching.